Oh, there we are. This is Pitt Street. With its uh, new shop on the corner, little hotel and all the rest of it. Now it says, it's got lots of inscriptions on the street. Somebody here wants. Let's see it. Somebody here, I can I want bolder architecture, says Shelby. We should respect others regardless of background. According to Jessica, The Forum Cinema. I can't see the famous lights which are supposed to be lighting up the street yet, but here I look. Always nice to bring out Norman de Brock to remember him. But it's a pity we don't know exactly what he did all those years. We know a bit about what went on during the occupation, but what was he fighting for? from all those decades. The Laurel and the Rose. Party politics in the 18th and 19th century. The Masonic Temple. Gallows Hill. the waterfront. So, post office. Now here's an interesting character. John Wesley. Well he was very briefly in Jersey. Does he want a memorial? The Jersey Cooperative Society, of course. Norman Le Brock over there was the public president for a long time. The Jersey Cooperative Society, I think, probably a founder member. Lots of others down there. The builders are still active, so we can't see them all. But the curiosity is still who was Mr. Pitt? Was he Moses Pitt? The 18th century merchant smuggler. Are we actually allowing a smuggler to be celebrated with street names in Jersey? We shall have to do some research. I think.